story to tell. In a national media reported that the destroyer HMS Defender and the Royal Netherlands Navy frigate HNLM Everset had quietly left the Black Sea since last weekend. Accordingly, the Royal Navy's HMS Defender spent a total of 18 days in the Black Sea area. As a rule, foreign warships are allowed to stay in these waters for no more than 21 days. These two warships are part of the British aircraft carrier strike group HMS Queen Elizabeth, which entered the Black Sea on June 14th. During their stay in the Black Sea, warships of the Royal Navy participated in a joint exercise with Ukraine and many other NATO countries. The exercise mobilizes the participation of 5,000 personnel, about 40 warplanes of all kinds, and 32 warships. This is considered the largest joint maritime exercise since the Cold War. Earlier while participating in the Black Sea, the defender of the Royal Navy was warned by Russian warplanes when it deliberately entered Crimean waters. However, the British side denied that there was no fire. Observers say that, with the departure of modern and dangerous British and Dutch warships, tensions in this area seem to have cooled down. However, it is not ruled out that this is just an exploratory move by the NATO Navy before sending a larger and more powerful force to this sea to counter Russia. HMS Defender is the fifth of the TAF-45 or Daring Class Air Defense Destroyers built for the Royal Navy. She is the eighth ship to bear the name. Construction of the Defender began in 2006, and she was launched in 2009. The ship completed her first sea trials in October and November 2011, and was commissioned during March 2013. HMS Defender has a displacement of about 1,000 to 1,500 tons. She has a length of 152.4 meters, beam is 21.2 meters, and draft is 7.4 meters. In keeping with its desired qualities, the HMS Defender is equipped with an innovative and advanced integrated electric motor system. It includes two Rolls Royce WR21 gas turbines with 28,800 horsepower H and two Wurzilla 12V200 diesel generators with 2,700 horsepower H. Defender can reach a top speed of 32 knots and has a maximum range of about 7,000 nautical miles. Classified as an anti-aircraft destroyer, HMS Defender's primary weapon is the Silver A50 40SL vertical launch system for Aster 15 and Aster 30 surface transmitters. Other weapons include one BAE 4.5-inch Mark 8 naval gun, two overlicken 30mm guns, two phalanx closing weapon systems, 
two miniguns, and six general-purpose machine guns. Her short-range armament gives her a notable punch against any approaching vehicles. It can also take on a fleet air defense role. Russia emphasized that within the framework of Sea Blizzard 2021, if NATO member states behave too aggressively, it can completely lead to full-scale military clashes. In response, the US has also shown that it is not easily bullied and will not hesitate to use force in response even in the event that Moscow attacks a British destroyer. The British, American, Dutch, and Italian warships are fully capable of fighting fairly with the Russian armed forces stationed in Crimea. My video about the HMS Defender Destroyer Ancier. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Tạm biệt và hẹn gặp lại quý vị và các bạn trong các video tiếp theo.